It was the biggest thing to happen in show business since the movies learned to talk. And we all sat there on pins and needles waiting for the reviews to come out the next morning. The only time in the history of the motion picture business a review was put on page one of the New York Times. And it's the top grossing film of the year and it only played in one theater. And it arrived on the scene as an industry was in crisis. Something had to happen. Television by now was making vast inroads and people just weren't going to the movies. So a Broadway showman, a Hollywood producer, and a famous adventurer and broadcaster banded together to create an entertainment phenomenon. And he turned to his press agent and said, this is the greatest thing since penicillin. We've got to get control of it. They worked so hard because they were so fascinated with what they were doing. Ladies and gentlemen, this is Cinerama. No human being had ever sat in a the theater and had this kind of a visceral experience and hit you right in the gut. And seven channel sound, which no one had ever done before. Pictures were still menorah in these days. We call this stereophonic sound. It started as a secret military training device in the 1940s. You had complete proof of the ability of this specific gunner of what his skill was. And this invention was credited with saving 300,000 lives during World War II. And it would thrill millions of theatergoers all through the 1950s by exploring the world with new eyes. And with Cinerama, you weren't just watching a thing happen on a flat screen. It was all around you, and you were literally in the picture. We dove inside this live volcano. The sulfur fumes from the volcano snuffed out all the oxygen for his twin engines. It was the hairiest thing I've ever been through in my life. You know, for audiences, they just ate this up, and they continued to. Well, the immediate impact was to awaken Hollywood, and exhibitors referred to Cinemascope as the poor man's Cinerama. And as the Cold War raged on, President Eisenhower felt that Cinerama could be used to enhance America's image around the world. There was even a plan to put Cinerama on a retired aircraft carrier and have it go around the world. This infuriated the Russians. Prompting the Russians to develop their own Cinerama-like system. Follow the crews, the cameramen, the explorers and the showmen as they journey through an incredible lost piece of Americana. Cinerama Adventure. The story of how the face of motion pictures was changed forever.